Sarah from Average Betty here and I'm making spicy tuna melts. Spicy tuna melts are as classy as using your outdoor voice all the time. Let's make spicy tuna melts. I have a big bowl here and this is a big can of tuna, fresh lemon juice, pepper, and salt. I'm heading down the Atlanta highway. Here's a few glugs of hot sauce. Not the one that rhymes with fiasco. You could also use a little chili powder, a little cumin is nice, a few chopped pepperoncinis, red onion, green onion works too, celery, love shack baby. Here's some mayonnaise, the good stuff. Here's some good melty shredded cheese. Get that moving around. A little taste. Mmm, maybe a little more hot sauce, salt, and pepper. This isn't rocket science, it's tuna salad. Set this aside for a moment and this is a baguette. Crusty on the outside, soft in the middle, doubles as a lightsaber. Na 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 Here's that tuna. Pile some of the tuna mixture onto each slice. Onto a baking sheet and here's some tomato. A little more cheese, just enough to get melty and hold everything together. Pop this into a preheated oven for a mere 10 minutes and you have snacks. There's nothing you and I won't do. Mm, it's not classy to talk with your mouth full. Get the spicy tuna melts recipe at averagebetty.com. So next time you're trying to keep it classy, I hope you give my spicy tuna melts a try. Thanks for watching and subscribing. See you next time. Mmm, spicy tuna melts.